All right, so here's uh, more longs of what I was talking about. What was my purpose? My purpose, like I said, was to come out here and get you guys to understand that the stock market is in, it, it's in total shambles. They're not over leveraged in just AMC. They're over leveraged across the board. There's short position in almost every stock. So AMC is really, it's not even just about AMC. It's the whole thing in general. And it will cause a stock market catastrophe across the board. Look at Tesla, look at um, Amazon, the darlings of the stock market, the blue chips and stuff like that. They've all fallen 50%. Um, so I wanted you guys to get on board with having some sort of plan of action in our back pocket should we get here and it didn't rip. And as I predicted, and as I thought, these $100,000 million price targets, because we've gone this far down, is not being met. In my strong, strong opinion, it will not be met. But I have continued to tell you guys that unfortunately, just, be, just for the simple fact, and it would take a very strong individual to actually, who has owned AMC, to actually sell their AMC, and never turn back and look at it. And just because you, most of us cannot do that. Like I can't even do that. Okay. I know that I sold off the other day and rebought 400, but I always had a little bit of shares because I'm always going to have at least a fucking pinky in this game because I would never want to see the situation where I didn't have uh, no shares and I'm looking back like, Oh shit, did it really run? And I didn't have shares. So the fantasy prices you can always um, have skin in that game with small amounts of shares. I mean, look, if we all own just a small amount of shares, we could afford to hold through small, uh, through large numbers. But there's a large majority of people that have a lot of shares that they're not going to be willing to ride through the hundreds. You know, even even past the uh, all-time highs, uh, 72. So going back to kind of more modern day, you know, more more uh, you know newer times, uh, like the past month what was my purpose my purpose is to try to vet the community a little bit more there's a lot of content creators they're all talking uh, virtually on the same message which was to hold 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 always hold you know hold through red hold through red and you were you know a lot of content creators were selling uh, you know we could reach 10 well, but if you really thought you were going to reach 10, then why would you promote people hold all the way down? Like when they're at, you would have told everybody, content creators, you would have told everybody at 30 that this is not what we came here for, right? We wanted to go to hundreds, thousands, hundreds of thousands, right? So 30 would have been a sale price, but you're also telling everybody that it could go to 10. So why would it be incorrect to sell at 30 and come back in at 9, 10? That doesn't make any sense to anybody. So I was trying to vet the communities. I, I, I was trying to vet the community. Content creators and commenters alike. I've already figured out the comment situation. That comment situation is meant to do one thing. And that's what I try to tell you, uh, content creators. Like, you're, you're responding to these commenters like they're really there as AMC long position holders. They're not. There's, there's infiltration in there coming from short positions that want to cause division. They'll choose every single moment the moment real people a couple real people get on board with bashing a youtuber for instance or they have an opinion that doesn't align with buy and hold they come out immediately immediately all these weird channel names so the comments are useless they're absolutely useless there's very few commenters out there that are actually invested long on amc and are just really interested in watching videos and commenting all the time. Let's be real, real people are not commenting on every single video unless they're really supporting. Why would you watch the same guy that you don't like and comment negatively on that person's video? Let me tell you how real people work. They watch a particular person, they watch a couple videos. If they don't like the content, they think like, oh, this guy's full of crap. You don't watch anymore. You don't come back to comment on the 30th video they've dropped, that's a sign that you're fake. So what did I do? I decided to challenge the commenters to come out as real people. Very small did, because I'll be honest with you, I believe that the majority of 
the viewership in AMC content creation is of negative force. Yes, we are onto something with AMC and the fact that we have decided to join in on those that figured out that AMC has a, a too heavy of a short position. It's over leveraged and it can be exposed if we ganged up as a retail investor and bought up the shares so that they can't find a way out. But nobody, nobody ever thought about what if they are able to manipulate it so that they can either drag it on forever, they can change the rules somewhere, they can ignore the rules, and as you can see, they've done all that. They ignore the rules, they manipulate, they cheat, okay? They have mainstream media in their back pocket. They can drop an article on Motley Fool Benzinga to the mass amount of public uh, followers that maybe don't look on YouTube for more of a real idea as to what's really going on. So I chose to vet the community by way of challenging them to turn the camera around from watching me to making a video, introducing yourself, let me see you. That way when you comment, when you do comment and I do pay attention to you, damn, I know, that's Dwayne M, I've seen him. On top of that, I asked you to show one shared position to show you've got skin in the game. Show the community that not only when you drop a video and show yourself that, hey, you're coming from a position of I'm an AMC long, I'm actually holding this stock, and I, in my opinion, validate you more than anybody. I'll end this video and drop another uh, part.